Erosion is one of the most common concerns on board a vessel as it reduces the lifespan and efficiency of the boiler water system. To achieve optimum corrosion protection, regular testing is essential. Nalfleet Spectrapack 310 is a low-pressure, medium-pressure boiler water test kit that lets you maintain control of the water quality of the boiler water system. This compact kit consists of three tests. The P-alkalinity test, chloride test and pH test. Maintaining a targeted oxygen scavenger residual is vital to reducing the risk of oxygen corrosion. The DEHA check it is designed to test and monitor the DEHA based oxygen scavenger in the boiler water system. In this video we'll be demonstrating how you can perform these tests. P-alkalinity test. Pour a 200 ml water sample in the stoppered bottle provided. Add one P-alkalinity tablet and shake to dissolve. If P-alkalinity is present, the sample will turn blue. Repeat tablet addition one at a time, giving time for the tablet to dissolve until the blue colour changes to permanent yellow. For the calculation, P-alkalinity measured in parts per million equals the number of tablets used multiplied by 20 minus 10. For example, if 8 tablets are used, take 8 multiplied by 20 minus 10, which is 150 parts per million. Record the result as parts per million calcium carbonate in waterproof. Chloride test. For boilers under 30 bar, pour a 50 milliliter water sample in the sample container provided. Add one chloride tablet and stir to dissolve. The sample should turn yellow if chlorides are present. Repeat tablet addition one at a time, giving time for the tablet to dissolve until the yellow color changes to permanent orange, red or brown. For the calculation, chloride measured in parts per million equals the number of chloride tablets multiplied by 20 minus 20. For example, if four tablets are used, take four multiplied by 20 minus 20, which is 60 parts per million. Record the result as parts per million chloride in waterproof. pH test. Pour 50 millilitres of boiler water sample in the sample container provided. Using the scoop provided, add one level scoop of the pH reagent to the water sample. Allow to dissolve. Stir if required. Select the correct range of pH test strip and dip it into the water for approximately 10 seconds. Withdraw the strip from the sample and compare the colour obtained with the colour scale on the pH indicator strips container. Record the results in waterproof. Carefully pour 10 millilitres of boiler water sample into cell A. Then pour the contents into the brown bottle provided. Add six drops of DEHA test solutions to the brown bottle. Close the bottle with a lid and swirl gently. Remove the lid, add one DEHA tablet to the brown bottle Crush the tablet in the solution using a different clean stirring rod. Close the cell with a lid. Swirl until the tablets are dissolved. Wait for 10 minutes to observe the complete reaction. The colour reaction should take place in the dark. 
Next, carefully pour 10 milliliters of border water sample into cell B. Add one DEHA tablet to cell B. Crush the tablet in the solution using a different clean stirring rod. Place cell B in the left-hand side of the compartment. Place cell A in the right-hand side of the compartment. Match the two colour fields against the north daylight and read off the results as milligrams per litre DEHA. Record the result as parts per million DEHA in waterproof. Always follow the instructions on the product data sheet. This ensures that your systems operate efficiently and maintain compliance with regulatory and OEM specifications. For more information, please reach out to Wilhelmsen Ships Service.